Discipline, it's about skill, it's about commitment, it's about dedication, it's about the tenacity to win against the odds. It's about the willingness to say that I will go the extra mile, even though at this point in time I'm exhausted, I'm tired, my muscles are aching, but I have a team counting on me, and more importantly, in their case, I have a nation counting on me. So I think that we should never let it be lost on us the fact that football is more than just quote unquote a game. There's so much more to it, and we collectively should leverage football to drive our country forward because, let's face it, it's one of the few things that we all agree on, right? Uh, when our national teams are playing, we don't talk about where we're from, we don't talk about what, what religion we have, we don't talk about our gender, we just support them. And once again, I believe that with the Black Queens going forward, they have the full support of us as a nation of Ghana. Um, of course, I can't um, end this uh, brief um, speech without mentioning, mentioning the Normalization Committee. Uh, first of all, uh, we are all, all four of us are truly honored to take on this responsibility. It's no mean responsibility, it is a, a lot of work, but we're honored uh, to be chosen as the people, really as the, the face of normalizing Ghana School. But, but you and I all know that it will take hundreds of people for that to actually happen. Um, hundreds of brain, uh, brain power, um, um, insight, in, in passion, interest, dedication, actual work. This is about work that we have to do to create our or, or reorganize our country's football into what we believe is possible. It's not about getting back to business as usual or restoration, it's about reformation. And that's what we're about. And I know that everybody here has a common interest to see that happen. So we have started work, um, and you'll be pleased to know that part of our plan is to come back and engage many people, also come back and engage and share our initial thoughts on how we see we can take uh, taking this, how we see this going forward. Um, so you can count on us for openness, transparency, um, and commitment to the goals and the objectives that are common to all of us. Um, and then without much more ado, I want to say thank you all for having me here today. Um, it's a pleasure and it's an honor. And um, Black Queens, um, we, we need some kind of slogan to, to, to encourage them that they will win this. We also need a win, right? Yes. yes. We need a win. Yes. Host and win. Yes, that's it, host and win. Thank you very much. Thank you. I will at all times well and truly serve the Republic of Ghana. I will at all times in the office of a member, uh, um, in the office of a member, of the Accra Venue Organizing Committee, of the 2018 African Women's Cup of Nations, and that I will uphold, preserve, protect, and defend the Constitution of the Republic of Ghana. And defend the Constitution of the Republic of Ghana. As by law established. As by law established. So help me God. So help me God. I think they deserve a round of applause.